So, other side of High Sense Stand, hello Tim, Happy New Year to you. Happy New Year. Uh, we're going to talk laser TV on this side of the stand. Uh, shot through projection, ultra shot through projection. It's a huge market now, but yes. High Sense were in there right at the start. Yeah, so High Sense really was one of the first two to, to the market of high, uh, short throw laser projection. Uh, heavy investment into the actual technology itself. So, in the UK, you know, uh, two years ago we launched the 88 inch. Uh, the 100 inch single laser that's now progressed the technology has now progressed as well into the trichroma laser as well um, and then that's obviously developed into the peak brightness has obviously increased as well the short throw distance has reduced as well so we've now got the l9 in the uk market which is the uh, trichroma 3000 nits uh, peak brightness that also has the vdu uh, six uh, smart engine also has a TV tuner built in as well. Um, so that is our flagship model for uh, for 2023, and, and that will continue to develop uh, going on. And other models that are there so, any lower down? Other models, yeah. So the the L9 is the trichrome, and that's a flagship model. That in the UK market that comes with uh, the actual panel itself. Also, Hisense is offering free installation on um, the premium models. We also have the L5, which is a single laser. Obviously, the peak brightness is not as high, um, and the, the color gamut is not as, as, as vast as that, but obviously, it's more of an entry-level uh, 100 to 120-inch um, uh, laser TV short throw project projection. And how have you found this market? I, I know it's, it's a booming market, certainly with enthusiasts, but the general public, are, are they interested in this? They are. I mean, they're interested in technology, because if, if you went to go and purchase a LCD, or an OLED for a hundred inch, or you know, or larger. Obviously, the, it's very costly uh, product. So we are bringing the more cinematic experience to the consumer with all the Dolby Atmos products. You know, uh, the, the technology that's in there. We actually bring in the cost of that cinematic experience down into the consumer. So people want bigger. You know, the market is growing. Fifty-five inch, sixty-five inch, seventy-five inch. They're the biggest parts of the market are growing, and obviously, this is a, a better way to bring that cost down to the product but to deliver the actual technology features as well. So I'm going to put you on the spot, go on. Uh, would you go with a laser TV or one of your mini LEDs or an OLED? Oh, it depends on obviously what you use it for. Me personally, you know, I use it for general streaming services, um, looking at Netflix, also have um, gaming as well. So I think from that respect, I would go with mini LED. But if I wanted a true cinematic experience and to have it in my cinema room as an impressive, I would definitely go for laser TV. It all depends on preference and well, size of your house, house obviously, as well. It's quite a big thing. And of course, uh, I think you're one of the only manufacturers that actually offer the screen to go with the projector as well. Yes, we are. So we have actually launched also the, uh, the PL, PL5 or PL1, sorry. Um, that comes without the screen. Um, but we are obviously one of the main manufacturers really that offer the, well, the screens calibrated for the actual short throw laser projection. Um, so the way it transfers the light into your eyes. So if you get too close to the screen, if you've got that close of an LCD screen, you can feel the intensity of the actual, the brightness of the LEDs. But with laser TV, because it's been reflected off of a specially calibrated screen, you know, the eye strain is a lot, lot less. OK, well, um, it's a cracking lineup we got from 2023. Uh, thank you very much for your time. No, and you. uh, we look forward to getting some of these products in later in the year. No, it'd be fantastic. I mean, it's, it's a big focus for us this year, mini LED, laser TV. So it's, it's, it should be a really good year for us, hopefully. Excellent. Thank you very much and Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you too.